The cone should be viewed no more than 10 seconds, meaning it, it's, it's sort of a table of contents to a book. A tropical cyclone is on the move. Forecasters issue what's called the forecast cone. It's thought to be a one-stop shop to predict the storm, but it's not. There's more to be uncovered. Sorry. It's important to remember when looking at the forecast cone that this indicates the central part of the weather system. It can range within this part of the cone and the cone expands with time to indicate uncertainty. It's also important to remember that the storm usually expands well beyond the forecast cone. So when looking at the cone, know that the impacts could go well beyond those boundaries. The cone gives us insight into the position, timing, and intensity of the storm, but it doesn't tell us the whole story. Everybody wants a, a one-size-fits-all graphic or an easy button, and unfortunately, hurricanes are really nuanced in that their hazards uh, you know, vary in time and space, and you've got to read the chapters to really understand what's going on. The full story of a hurricane includes storm surge, flooding, and much more. And that's why you'll want to learn the whole story and the details that impact you from the National Hurricane Center or with us here at Weather Nation. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Steve Glazier.